Yo, what's up guys, it's Dan here, and today I am bringing you guys another world record. What is the world record, you may ask? This one is the world's first drop zone chem strike, and I literally just downloaded the playlist, well not downloaded the playlist, downloaded itself, I was wondering what the message was. Instantly noticed that there was a new game mode which was highlighted in yellow, clicked on it and it said drop zone, popped into a game, chem strike, first game, boom. And I'm really, really happy with this gameplay because obviously I want to try and achieve a really nice early game uh, gameplay on a new game mode, I guess, Chem Strike, hopefully, which is what I did achieve. And I did it, I did it, and I did it quite well actually as well. I was playing solo because obviously you can tell it's like flipping really early in the morning, and um, I'm not exactly like I'm not. This it, video isn't really organised very well because I just want to get up as early as possible. And for those who are going to be speculating, saying Hey, this isn't the world's, re world's first because someone else has uploaded this before. Guys, let me tell you that I've already uploaded a raw video of the footage just in case someone, just in case while I was doing my commentary someone else was uploading it. So my raw footage was the first one that goes up and that's still technically my video. Therefore, it is the first, world's first drop zone chem strike. And for those who don't know what drop zone is, it's basically a care package game from MW3. Some people may be familiar with it, but for those who aren't, it's basically a return of sort of it's sort of a little mixture of hardpoint and care packages in. There's like a little certain area with like red smoke you have to hold down. And when you hold down the red smoke you earn care packages like every five to ten seconds, I believe. And um, whoever's holding it whoever's holding the team for longest will it, they will earn the chem strike itself. And uh, I don't know, guys. <laughs> it's not really something I know because I've only played one game, and it's just a bit different for me because I've, I've always been playing domination, and, that, and I don't really play drop zone. I've never played drop zone on MW3. I found it a bit boring. Um, one other thing you may have noticed that there's no specialist bonus, which is, which is sort of a bummer. But in fairness, it makes it realistic because otherwise people will be camping for their streaks and not for their kills. And yes, I know I was playing a bit defensive in this tube thing because I've never played. I I, I have played free fall before, but I rarely ever play free fall, and it's a really hard map to get uh, the spawns worked out on that. But obviously, after a while, I will learn the spawns and stuff like that. But back then, or well, back now, I don't really know the spawns greatly. So do. I don't know, cut me some slack I guess for this because it is a freaking world record and um, I do bring you one of these every once in a while not a bad world record as well I like being the world's first, not world's highest not world's longest or whatever but the world's first I like to get in there first before everyone else and um, yeah, that's basically it for the gameplay, I mean I go flawless at the end, you'll probably see it in the raw footage for those who still don't believe me, the raw footage will be in the description down below anyways you may, oh yeah, also you may see the videos a bit unorganised as I said before. I just want to get this video straight up and early as possible. It may just be some weird ass upload time. And uh, yeah, that's basically it for the gameplay. It's kind of ruined my upload schedule because I really didn't want to, um, I mean I was going to upload other stuff. But I'm still going to upload other stuff anyways. But yeah, hope you all have an amazing night, day whenever you're watching this and I'll see you soon.